Hello everyone and welcome to this beginner-friendly tutorial on Simpro software. So if you are new to Simpro, this guide will help you understand its core features and how to use it effectively. So this is for managing your business operations. So this website is a powerful tool designed for trade and service businesses wherein it helps streamline job management, scheduling, and then the invoicing. So by the end of this tutorial, you will be confident in using this website for your daily business activities. So here guys, what is this website? So the Simpro guys is a cloud-based job management software and it is designed specifically for trade and service industries such as the electricians, the plumbers, or the HVAC professionals and then more. So we're in, it helps the businesses efficiently handle job scheduling, invoicing, project tracking, and customer management. So the key features here is, they have here their job management. You can create, assign, and track jobs from start to finish. The invoicing, which is to generate professional codes and invoices with ease. The scheduling, assign jobs to team members and manage their workloads and then their inventory management you can keep track of stock levels and order materials and of course their reporting and analytics they generate reports to track the business performance so by using this website businesses can increase productivity reduce the paperwork and improve customer satisfaction so here guys, the first thing you need to do here is to open your browser and go to the Simpro website. Enter your login credentials and then it is provided by your company administrator. So in order for you to have an account um, from this website, you need to have an access coming from your co company administrator. So if you're a new user, you can request access from your administrator. So here guys, understanding the dashboard. So once logged in, guys, you will see the dashboard, which provides an overview of your pending jobs. So these are the jobs that need attention or are assigned to you. And then schedule appointments. So here, upcoming jobs for your team. And in the financial overview, um, this is a quick insights into the business revenue and outstanding invoices. And on your updating your profile, guys, you can click on your profile icon at the top right. There, you can update your name, contact details, and notification preferences. You can also adjust the settings based on your role with the company. And then, on creating a job in the Simpro, um, jobs are at the core of the Simpro's functionality. So, you can go through the step-by-step -step process of creating a new job. So, on navigating to the jobs module, you can click on the jobs tab in the main menu. You can create a new job there. And then on entering the job details, you just need to select an existing customer or you can also create a new one. So enter the job name and of course provide a detailed description. So, And then assign the job status and you can set a due date at a priority level. So here, on assigning technicians and scheduling work, you can choose one or more technicians to handle the job and then assign start and end dates. So you can also save and track the job here. So here you just need to click sub to finalize the job and then monitor job progress under the jobs module. So you can update job status guys as the work progresses. So on creating a code and invoices, so navigate to the codes module. Here you can click new code and enter client details. You can provide a clear description of services, set the pricing terms and additional costs you can also save and send the code for the customer approval and that's it guys that's a complete beginner guide to using this website so if you found this tutorial helpful don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more tech guides and thank you for watching and have a happy job managing with this website the same program.